not quite as high res, I'm I'm sure. Okay, guys, guys, sewer sewer episode, mine episode, totally not one of my biggest biggest dislikes in game. Can I sprint? I can actually sprint in here. Tunnel vision. Hey, it's actually lights, and the sounds are super creepy. So we're coming down to mines. Okay. Oh, all right. <laughs> so this is the entrance. Can I just like kick this door open? I've got a hand grenade with me. I found a hand grenade in the forest. Clearly better. <laughs> is this a spooky game? I think the spookiness is mostly in my head, but it is pretty, you know, because you don't really know. I don't really know what to like expect. Like anything can happen, but I've really enjoyed the game the uh, ride so far. Okay, that end is blocked off. I'm playing this so you guys know how- I, I can't play um, horror games like ever, but this is this is fine. This is more like my exploration and like I'm completely alone here and everything, so that's fine. Oh, there's a left downstairs. Oh shit guys, this go place goes just on and on and on. I think I, I need to take the lift, I'm pretty sure. Okay, I'm just checking out all the nooks and crannies. As I go down. Oh. Oh. I was maybe supposed to be on that. <laughs> um, okay, it's gone down now. <laughs> now we probably need to wait. Come on. Okay, it's going down an awful long time. Okay, this is a long, long, long ass mine shaft. Are you gonna stop and wink and someone you back up, you stupid lift? Maybe I was supposed to be inside it and then click the button. Come on, can I click up? Can I click up? Yes, thank you. Up. Are you coming? Okay, it's coming. I'm gonna try and inspect. I'm gonna see anything at all from here. No. This darkness. Darkness. Yeah, you guys are here. But I always see you. Don't look behind you. <laughs> I wish I could jump in this game though. But uh, not really. No. I need to go and get some drink because I'm running out of tea now. Oh, okay. It's that uh, set of buttons inside as well. <laughs> Alright. That explains. I don't know. Creepy, like. Locking myself in something like this. I wonder how deep this goes. This is, this looks like totally safe, right? Totally safe. <sighs> Two out of five on the spooky scare. No skeletons nearby, but kind of scared anyway. Yeah, there's some Blair Witch cult project <laughs> thingy going on here in this town like it's abandoned and we're seeing visions and there's a bit of a supernatural ghost thing to it but mostly like it's not spoopy as such in the sense that you can apparently uh proceed at your own pace you know there's no real hurry and you don't don't need to like fight anything or run away from anything you can kind of take everything at your own speed which is good. Just checking these side corridors here, they seem empty, so we'll just move forward. Deeper and deeper into the mine. So I wonder why Ethan was so adamant that he had to come here. Okay, I'm seeing blue light over there. Is this maybe? That's a dead end. I really don't want to get lost in here. I think I, yeah, I came from there. I'm gonna check these. Okay, they're all dead ends, so we're just gonna go into the light. Maybe go for a GED because you have no idea if you can mentally survive the zero. That school starts in 10 days. Nowhere near ready for it. Uh, is there anything in particular you might, you, you'll have to like, you know, apart from, you know, mentally preparing for it, but like, otherwise prepare for it. Creepy sounds. And what is that over there? I cannot tell. I wonder if I'm going to like find more dead people. But I wonder, like, Ethan was really adamant about getting here. He was like, I have to go there. Oh, mining tools. I'm hearing water. Inspect. Pickaxe rack. 
empty slots. Okay, I've got a feeling someone's been murdered with a pickaxe. Now we need to locate a missing pickaxe. I can't see shit. So we're in a very dark place. Okay, I'm seeing seeing something at the corner of the vision. Okay, there's a bit of light over there. It's in a very dark corner somewhere. Could it have been this place or maybe it was like in the next corridor? Might have been over there somewhere. Well, we need to find a pickaxe, that much we know now. Um, do you want to check out this this one? Seems like a dead end, alright. Maria says I enjoy school because you don't go to school and all kids are gone for your pocky stops now. <gasps> Enjoying school by proxy. Okay, oh, is this a well or is it just another like elevator slash mine shaft? That's actually, you know, flooded now. I don't know. Why is this? Oh, oh, what happens now? Well, I see what, what emerges from the water. It's gonna be a lift full of dead people, pretty sure. That's totally not creepy at all. Is that person? Oh shit, is this actually Ethan Carter? Is this the kid? Or is this, this, this is the lady, is it? Look broken from the outside. Victim John post mortem, anti mortem. This is the Missy. The, is it Ethan's mom? Okay, now we need to piece together what happened in here. So hang on, lock was broken. On the outside slash inside, I don't really understand. Why can I not? Well, I need to probably find the pickaxe and try and bash that thing open. <sighs> don't need games with dark thoughts. There was one year you stopped going around much, so you skipped half a semester because it got to the point where you had to completely turn pro. Nah, sorry to hear that. Probably full of dead people. Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> I'm just like imagining the worst here. Well, what's worse what's pretty certain is someone probably locked her in there and then just made the lift go down and you know she couldn't get out of it so she drowned once it hit the water which is like a horrible completely awful awful way to way to go and that's actually one of the things i've had nightmares about um i'm just gonna check out all the corners here so you see i'm trying to imagine the worst all the time when i'm playing this so when stuff happens, it's actually not the worst. <laughs> like, I try to be prepared for the worst. Okay, this just looks like a place I'm totally gonna get lost in. Better use history course because you couldn't even stand being in the classroom. Had to take the class in a completely separate room. Oh, sorry to hear that. Well, you can most likely retake that, right? Okay, this is some sort of mine cart. Enter. Well, this doesn't go anywhere, though. But maybe I can at least enter this and get some feels. Oh, you can in fact operate it. Turn on. But what does it do? Does it clear rubble or not clear rubble? Okay, it just went wherever. What's this thing supposed to do? I don't know what it does. It was, but wasn't there like rubble in here? Oh, oh! I can actually, I can actually drive this thing. So we're gonna turn that shit off. I wonder what happened. What, what did I do now? I cleared some rubble with it. Hey, I can actually. Yeah, I think I can take the mine cart over there now. I would say. And then can I maybe use those things to change the tracks? Switch the tracks around, maybe. Uh, I got a minecart now, guys. I got a minecart. I wonder if it does anything over here. So that's the. I mean, I can probably ride it all the way here as well, like around this. Rail stop simulator. I know. It doesn't seem like I can interact with these things. Because I I've got a feeling I probably need to take the minecart over there. But let's have a look. Turn on. So can I just like write this thing now? Oh, it's not. Is it going? It is going this way. I should be able to. Can I like get? 
Yeah, it starts going that way. I need to. I, I've got a feeling I need to take the part is that big deep, deep tunnel. Can I maybe change, change the? No, turn off. I want to turn it off every time because I'm paranoid. Can I, can I change these? No. Or hang on. Do I maybe need to? Go around and then come back. Well, we'll, we'll just try it, try and write this thing one more time. Right now, forwards, onwards to victory. Let's see how far can we write this thing. Watch out for creepers. Yeah. <laughs> School's been undergoing renovation all summer. Can't wait to see what. Hey, we're actually going in forward now. Can't wait to see what it's like. Hope you have actual floors. What sort of non-actual floors did you have before? Can to turn that off? Or no, it's all dark now. Okay, I need this thing for the lights. Or I can't inspect anything in darkness apparently. Turn on. So there was something in here I was able to inspect. But now it's it's not on? Oh, is this thing okay? I need to back this thing a little bit so that the thing I want to inspect is illuminated. I've got a feeling, maybe, maybe. No, oh no, 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 we're not supposed to turn it off like this, and then we exit, maybe. This thing. Oh, it's not getting inspected now either. Hang on, how do I, how do I get that prompt to appear again? You need to go, like go back or something. It was like saying before that there's th things to inspect, or do I need to be on this thing to inspect it? No. Hit it with a pickaxe. Yeah. But it's like okay now the inspect thing is on. Can I get off now and then? Go and inspect it. All right. Oh, well, it's well illuminated in any case. This one, <clears throat> yeah, I was gonna say it, but you know, you guys know what I'm gonna say. It doesn't have any blood on it, so it probably hasn't been used as a murder weapon. I'm gonna take it anyway. So someone smashed something into pieces. At least we've found one clue, but we'll probably have to find something else now to complete the puzzle, so then we can read the dead lady. So we need to. I know we'll need to take the pickaxe back to where we found it before. I'm gonna ride the cart now. I hope it's got enough gas. There's gonna be like creepers coming through. What's that? An illuminated tunnel over there. It's like shit. I can't see anything over over this mine cart, so it's a bit like where am I going? I only murder the switch, I'll barbaric. Maybe I should have checked that one illuminated tunnel there. Just because it was illuminated. But I'm probably coming to the like, and and here am I more illuminated is this the end now okay that actually was the end um exit we'll just check out this tunnel and then maybe take the minecart back to the beginning well oh wait, is this hot springs oh or acid can it be acid can I go in, in this oi I can actually go in this. Can I hurt myself? No. <laughs> I can actually like either swim or wait through this. What spring? This is new. And it's probably not acid because I'm not melting. Now I want to go and inspect that other tunnel in the uh, to the side as well. Are, are we going to come to some crazy cultist? If this was an RPG, we would be coming to some sort of. Um, cultist slayer right now. Are we coming to a cultist slayer? Okay, more mines. I'm getting so lost now. I could feel two kinds of darkness here in Red Creek Valley. Okay. The first, you walked into, and with any luck, mm -hmm. walked out of. Walked out the of. The other darkness was deeper, stickier, mm -hmm. uh, unknowable, and it wanted me to leave. Oh. 
Salt is